January 30, Monday Morning Meditation. It is unlikely President Theodore Roosevelt intended that one particular excerpt from Citizenship in a Republic would become the most inspiring quote of our time. The Rough Rider gave us the man in the arena as he spoke in 1910 at the Sorbonne in Paris. Part of a broad edict to the world leaders assembled to rise up to the challenges of humanity and humility. It is not the critic who counts, not the man who points out how the strong man stumbles or where the doer of deeds could have done them better. The credit belongs to the man who is actually in the arena, whose face is marred by dust and sweat and blood, who strives valiantly, who errs, who becomes short again and again, because there is no effort without error and shortcoming. But who does actually strive to do the deeds, who knows the great enthusiasms, the great devotions, who spends himself in a worthy cause, who at best knows in the end the triumph of high achievement, and who at the worst, if he fails, at least fails while daring greatly, so that his place shall never be with those cold and timid souls who neither know victory nor defeat. Roosevelt's next words are almost unknown, yet exhibit the same timelessness of application to our world today. Let those who have keep, let those who have not strive to attain a high standard of cultivation and scholarship. Yet let us remember that these stand second to certain other things. There is a need of sound body and even more of a sound mind. But above mind and above body stands character, the sum of those qualities which we mean when we speak of a man's force and courage of his good faith and sense of honor. We must ever remember that no keenness and subtleness of intellect, no polish, no cleverness in any way make up for the lack of the great solid qualities. Self-restraint, self-mastery, common sense, the power of accepting individual responsibility and yet of acting in conjunction with others, courage and resolution, these are the qualities which mark a master for masterful people. Without them, no people can control itself or save itself from being controlled from the outside. This week, meditate on the meaning, the inspiration, the call to action for us all. Let's get in the race.